cyber attack, uh, there have been cyber attacks in Irish hospitals and in the Irish health system. Uh, we recently uh, had a laboratory system attacked and had to take it offline. So we couldn't look at results for patients for a period of uh, three days and we had to actually rebuild the system. So cyber attack is a big challenge for us. Um, the safety of our systems and the investment we need to avoid cyber attack and to um, optimize is something that we're currently engaged in uh, spending money on. So the IT teams in hospitals are critical to protecting um, healthcare teams and healthcare resources. And the work of Panacea, which is both looking at the technologies and also the human behaviours, is critical because our, our doctors and our junior doctors, our nurses and our therapists must have easy access to information, but also must access in information in a way that keeps that information safe. There are a couple of drivers. One driver is to avoid a risk, uh, which is a risk of attack and a risk of failure and a risk of um, maybe information sharing without consent. So I think on that side, there is a fear-based reason to say we must avoid these things. Um, I think more positively, there is also the opportunity to look at what technology can do to support care. And so it's very important that we have the right technologies available for our doctors and nurses at the point of care. And a good implementation of a Panacea Toolkit will assist with this. Music